I've been using the Cosmonaut stylus for a really long time in making my Explain Everything animated clips, but I thought it was time to upgrade. So I'm going to try out this, the Adonit Pixel. Let's get into it. So let's have a look at what the uh, pixel looks like. So I've taken it out of its box and you get the uh, great little pixel there and then also a little USB charger. So to charge it, just goes in to your regular USB slot and I actually managed to charge it using a phone wall charger. Attach it, it magnetically sticks, which is nice, and then just pop it in. So, the Pixel's quite small in comparison to the Cosmonaut, which is quite a chunky stylus. However, um, still feels nice, just like a regular pen. Um, and it does have a pressure sensitive tip, though I do not have an iPad that is pressure sensitive since I've just got an iPad Air. So let's see how it goes with my app. Alright, so I use the Explain Everything app, um, and if you haven't looked at Explain Everything, Everything before, it's fantastic, it's available for a range of different platforms. Um, I simply import my lecture slides in here, or alternatively, alternatively I can just draw something directly. But when I'm using the Pixel, the first thing I need to do is I actually need to set up the fact that I'm using a stylus. So the uh, Wacom ones, the these are all Bluetooth styluses, sorry, that I'm thinking of here. So I turn on the stylus, I need to turn on the pen. So I just actually hold the pen until the little green light flashes on, and then connect it. Uh, of course, you need to make sure you have Bluetooth on, on your device. All right, now what I did find before when writing with my finger um, is that I often had a lot of skipping um, with my stylus. So if, if I was writing quickly, I'd get a lot of skips in words and gaps. But what I found is that I'm certainly not having anywhere near as many of those with the pixel. Now, one of the great things about using a stylus, and normally I have my lecture slides, I can highlight. Um, I love using the cursor because then, and I always use the big cursor so that students can see what I'm, I'm going on about, but when I say okay, I'm looking at this item here, um, you get all of that information. And of course, it's really easy using the record button there uh, to actually record and then export my Explain Everything videos. So I'm pretty happy with the Pixel. It seems to be a really nice tool uh, and I look forward to actually checking out how it goes in my next large lecture. We're certainly, we're often pressed for time and we're condensing in a lot of material um, and having a good stylus is going to be really important. So I hope you found the uh, review of the Pixel useful. Uh, remember that if you did find it useful Make sure you give us a like, and uh, if you haven't already, subscribe to us on the bottom button just down there on YouTube for more clips. Mm -hmm.